We are learning more tonight about how a jury found Jeffrey Basil guilty of murder. Our first question was where we all stood. First time tonight, one of the jury members behind that guilty verdict from yesterday is coming forward. She sat down one on one with 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ed Grant. She joins us here now with a 7 Eyewitness News exclusive tonight. Ed? And Keith, jurors had to consider Basil's mindset before, during, and after he pushed Bill Sager down the stairs inside Molly's pub last May. For some jurors, it was what happened after the push that made them choose murder. His life is over, but you choose that life. Juror number 12 says it was Jeffrey Basil's cold heart, his complete disregard for Bill Sager that helped her convict him of second degree murder. It was his anger, his rage. It was everything that takes you to that one step up of murder in a second. But murder was not her first instinct. Juror number 12 says she was in the minority, thinking manslaughter was the right choice to make. We went around the table, and it was a decision of nine to three. It was the question and confusion surrounding intent. Did Jeff Basil mean to kill Bill Sager early Mother's Day morning inside Molly's pub? I think questions started as soon as we sat down. They posed three questions to the court about intent. We all wanted to make sure we understood the definition. We all, because with us being nine to three, we wanted to make sure that we all understood it the same. And at the end of the day, they all did. I'm glad it's over. Um, it was emotional, up and down. I cried. Testimony from one of Sager's military buddies, Matt Baird, had her choked up. Baird was tending to Sager in the parking lot after he was pushed. Basil tried to get Baird to leave. Well, Matt Baird says, hey, that's not the way I was trained. I'm in the guard with this guy. And if he's down, I'm waiting. With military experience herself, juror number 12 understood what that meant. You never leave a man behind. And that was that was heartfelt to me. Over eight days, this juror heard hours of testimony and saw graphic videos, but no emotion from Jeffrey Basil. I knew the evidence. We studied it. We knew every step, every action that he took. And yes, he got everything he deserved. It took jurors about seven hours over two days to convict Jeff Basil of second degree murder. He'll be sentenced late next month. Reporting live tonight, Edge Ranch, 7 Eyewitness News. All right.